Welcome back to Odyssey News. I am Mike Odyssey. And what if I told you that the game that you are currently watching on your screen right now is on the Nintendo Switch 2? Intrigued? Let's get started. Welcome to the Odyssey. Hit the like, press play. You're running with the squad like Zeno Blade. Drive like Mario. We on a... So before we get into today's stories, you see, I want to ask you one thing. I want to ask for your subscription. You see, I'm legally blind and I'm basically losing my sight uh, as we go. I don't have sight on my left eye and I have about 40% sight of my right eye. And it's just fading away, right? The doctors right now have nothing else they can do. But I have a dream to become a full timer on YouTube by the end of this year. And I, I'm, I want to ask you for your help. Uh, if you subscribe to this channel right now, it'll only take a second. For me, it'll just change my life. So if you could do that right now, I would really appreciate it. Here we have Monday through Friday Nintendo news. On the weekends, we have products and reviews. And we also have the occasional and topic podcast with your favorite voice actor. So I would really appreciate it. It will mean the world to me. And I just want to thank you in advance for giving me your subscription. Let's move on to today's stories. All right, so first up in rapid fire news, we have a rumor that Nintendo is currently working on an HD version of Paper Mario Thousand Year Door for the Nintendo Switch this year. It's very credible because Nintendo basically, you know, this is a transition year, so we're going to get a lot of ports, and it's true that, hey, I want to play this game when it comes out. In other news, we got Super Bomberman R2, which is launching in september of 2023 for the nintendo switch so that game is going to be free on nintendo switch and it's launching in september so stay tuned for that in other news we got peaches 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 the song from the super mario brothers by none other than jack black bowser is eligible to be nominated for the oscar which is pretty cool not only is he breaking records as a movie but now that 59 second song is eligible to be nominated for the oscar which is crazy that is gonna do it for rapid fire news let's go ahead into today's big story so i came across this story by visiting doc trey 81's youtube channel you can see it right here on screen go ahead i'll, ha I'll have the link down below in the description of the sources where he went on some type of an investigation when it comes to job postings, right? And uh, he found this job posting for the, the the game that you saw earlier in the, the this video for Dune, okay? At, at the time of the posting, it was for a Dune IP. The game was not announced yet, but now, as of today, the game is announced. And as you can see here, it does mention that the game will be available on Xbox One, PS4, Nintendo Switch, or PC. Now, there's been a slight change to this because guess what? Ever since then, somebody was hired, somebody worked on this game, and somebody has that on their resume. Let's go ahead and take a look at it. Now, we are here at LinkedIn, and this is the resume for the person who worked on that Dune Awakening, which is now the title of the trailer you saw earlier in the video, and you're watching it now. Dune Awakening, right? So it looks here, same exact company that was hiring, but if you can take a look here, Dune Awakening says PC, PS5, Xbox, and TBA. Yes, my friends, this has to do with the next-gen Nintendo Switch. PC is already there. PlayStation 5 is already there. Xbox is already there. And to be announced. What are we waiting for, guys, to be announced? Tell me down below in the comments. Yes, we're waiting for the next Nintendo console to be announced. We saw in the prior listing that this was a, a game that they, that were they, they were hiring this v, uh, VFX artist in order to work on it. And back then, when they were hiring it, uh, it was supposed to come on the Switch. Look at the game that got delayed and it got pushed forward. But now, instead of coming on the Switch, it's coming on TBA. It's coming to, to, to be announced. We're basically the the next Nintendo console because we have all the all the consoles. PC can also be Steam Deck, right? PS5, PlayStation, of course. Xbox is Xbox, and then we also have the TBA, which is basically the, the slot where Nintendo is supposed to be, where the Switch was supposed to be. Apparently, it's not coming. It's not coming for the Switch. It's too. Th this game is too graphic demanding to be on the Switch, and it's now coming to the next gen Switch. Now, let me tell you what I feel, what I believe this is. 
TVA to be announced, to me, this is this is this just speaks loud, speaks words. It means it's coming soon. This game right here is coming soon to Nintendo Switch. Or Nintendo Switch 2. Whatever they that they decide to call it. I'm I'm really like every day more and more. I'm leaning more away and uh, from from the Switch name, and I feel like like they might call it something else to completely differentiate differentiate the next gen console, and and who knows what they're gonna call it. But this is just a little bit more proof that Nintendo is working on next on a next gen console. I believe, I do believe that console is done. I do believe it's in production, and I do believe we are going to hear something very very soon so there you have it i'm gonna leave it right there guys you guys let me know what you think in the comments um basically this dune awakening is gonna be out on playstation 5 on xbox series x and s and and, and x and also tba which is <laughs> to be announced which is nintendo it, it, it said switch before but now it says tba so it's gonna be on the next gen nintendo console which should be appearing any moment now. My prediction is June for us uh, for uh, I would say a fall release, but who knows? It's up to Nintendo for them to announce it. It's gonna be great. I can't wait. I'm excited, and let's talk about it down below. That is gonna do it for this episode of Odyssey News. But before I let you go, I have two important things I need to let you know. Number one, never ever give up, and number two, journey on. Peace. We are on a journey Looking back on the things that we've taken for granted But feels like we're learning To be better